The plant-based food trend is going to the dogs. Yeah, we had to do that. Yeah. Wild Earth is launching a high-protein, meat-free food for our furry friends. Here now is the man behind the innovative product, Ryan Bethencourt, joins us now. Um, hi, hi, Melissa. Hi. What, what gave you this idea? Because dogs, it seems like they love the meat. They, they do. So, you know, we, um, you know, I'm a longtime animal lover. Um, I've been, you know, I've had lots and lots of dogs and cats. Um, and I, I wonder what we were feeding them. And so I, I just assumed it was, you know, it's pretty much high quality protein, right? It's, uh, one of our big focuses is protein, whether it's from meat, from plants, from fungi. Um, it's really important that they have high quality, clean protein. The more I looked into it, the more I realized that the protein that we feed our pets is actually non-human grade. Uh, it's what's called four Ds. So uh, dead, diseased, disab disabled, or dying animals. So imagine a cow drops dead in a field. You can't feed that to a human. You'll go to prison for that. Okay. But you can feed it to a pet. I, we don't want to make our viewers throw up. I understand yeah. what you're trying <laughs> yeah. to say there. So you see where um, I'm going? So I, I see where I, you're going. But here, but, but at the same time, that's still not necessarily an argument for giving them vegetables because you wonder... You know, it seems like they should eat what they would most naturally be eating out in nature if they weren't our pets. And, and to that point, so we called a couple vets. One, mm -hmm. Dr. Brian Martyr Greenvale said, I think this will turn out to be a fad diet for dogs. Dogs are carnivores. Therefore, their mm -hmm. digestive system has developed to absorb meat. I yeah. prefer companies that do the most research, Royal Canine, Science Diet, Purina, the kibble of yesterday has been vastly improved. There's no problem feeding just dry food to dogs. So you don't have to feed them, you know, cows that are diseased. Um, and, they, and they're carnivores. So how do you respond to that? Because no doubt that's so, not the first time you've so, that. So I 100, no, yeah, for sure. I 100% disagree with him that dogs are carnivores. We know that dogs are actually omnivores like us. A lot of people have that misconception that they're actually carnivores. Uh, dogs can survive and thrive on a plant-based diet. We've seen it over and over again. Um, there is still very much like in the human space, there's still a lot of disagreement around nutrition. So there are some people in the human space that really believe paleo is the way, some believe a plant-based diet is the way. Um, so that's really the, you know, what we're seeing in the human space. We're now starting to see that in the pet space as well. Yeah. I, on the human side, you know, when we've looked at these meat patties, they end up having more sodium, you know, the same amount of calories, um, many more carbs. So it's plant-based, but it's not necessarily better for you by a long shot. It's just this idea that you don't want to eat an animal. Is this actually healthier or is it just avoiding meat? So, so 100%. I believe it's 100% healthier, and I'll tell you why. So what we've seen is when you look at the human space versus the pet space, it's very different. So pets are fed non-human grade meat. We've seen euthanasia drug getting into their meat, so contaminated meat. Um, I think last year there were about over 100 million recalls of pet food. This year we've seen uh, actually pet parents. Now, you know, the yeah. new millennial trend is calling them pet parents. We've seen, um, we've actually seen pet parents and their dogs getting sick with salmonella when okay. people have mm -hmm. been feeding them pig's ears. So, so there is a better path. Okay. Um, and we think that's clean protein. Ryan, thank you for coming on. I wish we had more time. Good stuff. You're, you're welcome. You. Thanks. Check wow. us out on wildearth.com. Thanks. One final. That's it. Get the, the plug in. One.